A plan is being floated to connect two of Brown County's cultural centers at one location. The county executive is looking to combine Brown County's library and the Neville Public Museum. Now, the so-called cultural campus would be located on the west side of the river near the Neville Museum. Right now, the library is on the east side of the river. Fox 11's Beth Jones brings us multiple views of the possible merger. The Neville Public Museum may soon have a neighbor. That's if a vision from Brown County Executive Troy Streckenbach becomes a reality. It's about looking at the future and how we can maintain the quality of our cultural institutions. The idea came to light during the State of the County Address Thursday night. Streckenbach feels it would benefit both facilities by increasing foot traffic as well as provide additional opportunities downtown. I think this has a great idea of a kind of a, fam a new family destination. It merges very well with what's happening with uh, on Broadway and on Washington Street <laughs> along with the, uh, uh, the KI expansion. I think this all fits very nicely into a large package. A lot of museums are struggling. We're trying to be more relevant. So this could have a positive impact. Those at the Neville say the merger is worth looking into, but the museum is also looking into changes of its own, a possible multi-million dollar expansion. That plan includes a new atrium at the front of the museum. We were moving forward independently, but this idea is worth exploring even though we all know that the devil is in the details. Library officials feel the same way. They say the current facility is in desperate need of upgrades. However, some projects have been put on hold while they check into this proposal. We have taken a pause on that because, again, you know, where is the library going to be? What is the future of the library? Because we don't want to start doing renovation if, in fact, let's say we were to move to a different location or were to do some other change. Streckenbach says this is just a vision at this point, so it's still unclear whether both facilities would be under one roof or if a new building would be built. In Green Bay, Beth Jones, Fox 11 News. Now, Streckenbach hopes to develop a task force to lay out the framework in the near future. As for a price tag, well, that is still unclear.